Racing against time, Donald Trump is employing new tactics to win over voters just three months before Election Day. The Democratic Party has failed and betrayed the African-American community. Sticking to his script Tuesday, Trump made an appeal to black voters in Wisconsin. Hours later, he promoted a prominent Republican female, who's an expert on women trends, to be his campaign manager. And after sliding in swing state polls against Hillary Clinton, the Republican presidential nominee announced he'll finally begin spending money on television ads in Florida, Ohio, North Carolina, and Pennsylvania. The moves come amid a campaign shakeup for the billionaire businessman, who's making a late push to turn things around before early voting starts next month. We're beefing up our field operations, our data operation, and we feel really good about expanding this team. Trump's team has its work cut out for them. According to WSJ NBC News poll data, Trump has just 1% support among African American voters, compared to 91% for Hillary Clinton. Trump is losing women 36% to 51%, a 16 point margin. He's also losing men by a one point margin. And Trump is struggling in swing states, down by five points in Florida and Ohio, nine points in North Carolina, and 11 points in Pennsylvania. On a conference call with journalists Wednesday, Hillary Clinton's campaign manager, Robbie Mook, expressed doubt about Trump's ability to pivot. Trump's advisors insist that he can turn things around quickly after a rough month on the campaign trail. But Trump himself admitted to a Wisconsin news station this week that he doesn't want to change. I don't want to pivot. I mean, you have to be you. If you start pivoting, you're not being honest with people.